Welcome. <laughs> Uh, we've had a, uh, here is the thing, everybody who was in our uh, meeting just now is wide awake. So uh, I'm not worried about people falling asleep at lunch, uh, which is all good. Uh, this is always a really fun lunch for me, but especially this year, since it turns out that uh, in the class, uh, are many distinguished people, including uh, David Levy and Ricky and I, and we thought we were going to do the wave or something, but we'll, uh, we'll say that. So uh, let me begin by saying uh, that we are in the happy situation of acknowledging uh, several members who are 50-year members. And I'm going to read uh, their name, and if they could stand, and David Levy has a 50-year medal for each of them. I feel today that I've been here for 50 years, so if you gave me a medal, I wouldn't turn it down. <laughs> so, uh, first, Boris Auerbach. Professor Paul DeWitt Carrington. Samuel Stern. And we had uh, a member we were very excited about presenting to. Carl uh, Auerbach passed away in April at 100 years of age. But his daughter is an ALI member. I know he was so proud of that. Uh, Linda Auerbach Allardyce, and she's with us today to accept his medallion. And I think we can say after hearing Justice Stevens at 96, I don't know what to say. I mean, you guys are a mere nothing. It was Justice Stevens was so inspiring in every way. Let me now ask uh, all of the life members of our class to rise so everybody, so we can say thank you to you and I especially applaud you. And now let me ask for the presentation of the class gift. Uh, this year, our co-chairs, if they would all come up, I would really appreciate this. Uh, first, Linda Cheryl Green, Michael Kahn, Mike McKetta, and Henny Wright. Don Ayer, who is an active member of this class, could not be here today. Please stand here, and I understand that Mike will speak for the class. And you're speaking for me, Mike, so... I'm speaking oh, for you, yeah. okay, then I better not screw it up too badly. <clears throat> First, I want to thank co-chairs, Don Ayer, who couldn't be here, and Linda and Henny and Michael. What fun to work with them. The five of us had the great pleasure over the last half year to visit with each of you in our 25-year class. And in doing that, we were able to enjoy a lot of reflections uh, and to discuss as well our collaborating and to come up with the gift that uh, Roberta is waiting for. <laughs> we heard poignant memories, we heard similar themes, and I wanted to read one that I just was touched by, and it went like this. I'm not sure why I pledged as much as I did. <laughs> I'm a law professor. Not starving, but hardly flush. But the Institute means a great deal to me, and I'm proud to be an active member. As others have said before me, this member said, the level of intelligent discourse and discussion, both at the annual meetings and in consultative group and advisors meetings, is as high as the level of respect and gentility. And we heard wonderful memories like that over and over. Now, Roberta, you know that our class of 1991 is not very tribal. It's not like high schools or college reunions or law schools, no t-shirts. <clears throat> but we have a lot in common. And I thought it'd be fun to share a little bit of the memories that we have in common. Uh, one is that we're all honored to serve in the work of the ALI, which has, since 1923, had the mission that I like to reread, if you don't mind my rereading one more time, 
to promote the clarification and simplification of the law and its better adaptation to social needs, to secure the better administration of justice, and to encourage and carry on scholarly and scientific legal work. And some of the memories that we share today, those of us in the room that started in 1991 got to see the concluding years of the great project on corporate governance, what a landmark. And now we get to see the beginning years of the principles of police investigation and the restatement of the law of children and the law. And throughout our 25 years, we've worked on 61 projects. Together, we've enjoyed the leadership of four presidents. We all enjoyed the presidency of Rod Perkins, Charlie Wright, Michael Trainer, and our own class of 1991, Roberta, and soon the leadership of our own class of 1991, David Levy. And together, we enjoyed the wisdom and the energies of three directors, of Jeff Hazard, Lance Liebman, and our own class of 1991, Ricky Rivez. And I couldn't help remembering that together we shared 38% of the 65 years of Bennett Bosky's membership in the ALI. <laughs> <clears throat> and our dear Bennett has now joined that eternal fellowship of emeritus members of the ALI, and he's surely now their treasurer. <laughs> our gift that we've collected together lets us participate together another way, and that's financially supporting the work of the Institute. And there are really three substantial ways that our monies will assist. One is in the projects, including stipends for the underpaid and overworked reporters. One is for accessibility, reducing barriers to participation, both by assisting people that otherwise could not afford to come to members' consultative groups and also for expense reimbursements for judges and for nonprofit lawyers. And a third way is that we help the future because this funding also helps the funding of the Young Scholars Program. There are 95 of us in this class. We shared with great generosity, about two-thirds participated. Everybody in the class in this room gave. The gifts ranged from $30 to $15,000. The arithmetic average was 2,600. The uh, mean was 2,000, and the total gift that we are now giving to the ALI for those important purposes is $159,630. <laughs> and as you know, that exceeds the target, target we'd hoped for, but Ricky and Roberta have reminded me there's no deadline on additional <laughs> supplemental gifts. <clears throat> I want to give one last word of thanks and would ask if Beth Goldstein and Kyle Jacob might stand up. They are the force. There's Kyle, where is Beth? They are the force and the power behind this emerging effort to energize our class members into the kind of contributions as we've seen this year. And finally, I want to thank you, our fellow New Life members, for your generosity and for your participation in the work of the Institute. Thank you, Roberta. Thank you. There, Mike, Mike, Mike. Ah. So uh, let me, on behalf of the Institute, thank each and all of you. And uh, what we have, but we won't take out for everyone, uh, is this wonderful uh, piece that has today's date. And it says, with deep appreciation for your outstanding work as co-chair of the 1991 Life Member Campaign. I want to say how fabulous it was when I called each of these people to say, and I'm always hesitant to do this, would you, there was not a moment's, yes, we, would, we believe in the Institute and we understand that we need to gain support. And what I hope is that our class leads the way in continuing to give to the ALI, and I hope that you remember us in every way possible. So thank you all very, very much. Great. Thank you.